Hold it, Hedgehog! Before you embark, there is one other scenario to consider. All right. I'm listening. Moments ago, your friends sacrificed their corporeal forms to suppress your cyber corruption and return you to this dimensional plane. They were so close to being free again, and they gave it all up for me. I don't care how many islands or titans it takes, I'm getting them back this time. <clears throat> Please, no tedious speeches about the superpower of teamwork. millions of calculations, there was one so remote and unlikely I did not consider it. However, as things stand, it could be the one to save us all. Well, I'm all about beating the odds. What's the plan? I can reverse your friends' efforts and restore them. They would then seek out the Chaos Emeralds for us. I can stabilize your cyber corruption for a brief time, and then I would guide you on how to convert that corruption into power so that you may end this conflict and save Father. And save the world, too, right? It is his to conquer, so yes. Yeah, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. I like that plan. Let's do it to it. Be forewarned, the trials you face will be grueling, and we will have precious little time. Please, I live for time trials. Let's go already. Just tried to save you. I'm not doing it again. Sonic? What's going on? I know it's been rough and that things are confusing, but I need you guys to just follow my lead. I need you three to find the Chaos Emeralds while I take care of something else. All right. We trust you. You can count on us. Piece of cake! Get on with it already! It's coming. Alright, time to find some emeralds. The Chaos Emeralds always wound up in the Ancients' vaults. Let's look there! Securing Emeralds in vaults? What will they think of next? Don't rush me, I'm looking! Wait, it's not here? Why isn't it here? The vault I found was empty. I'll try another. You should too. What good are these vaults if they don't do their job? I'll find them. It's just a matter of time. Maybe I can get some insight with my fortune cards. Huh. Mm. Oh. All the cards are telling me is that things are obscured and danger approaches. I knew that already! Wait! Seek insight from unfamiliar places? Ooh, the Coco! Of course! They should be able to help. All the vaults are empty! Wait, you have a lead? Tell me what you find. What if someone beat us to the roof? Huh? The Babylon Rose! They better not have her! I'll bust huh? them up! Uh, oh, forget the vaults! I'll find them the old-fashioned way. You search for them however you want. Now 
なあてむやぼるなかよむばおよのけいべのないカルベロに Oh, it was my pleasure I'm hoping now you can lead me in the right direction Do you know what happened to the chaos emeralds? いめぞめそべこえりえはむぼんずいきあなまたでめるすどうでのいぜあらあらいぞしのえなかった。Abitha? Hello. I'm sorry to disturb you, but you may be our last hope. Can you tell me what happened to the Chaos Emeralds? Suru Nibeno Naib. Sumir. Momu. Moravritina. Isma. Momusa. Thanks for the insight. We won't let you down. Thanks for the help, Amy. I would have been in real trouble without you. <laughs> Don't worry about it. I told you I'm not just gonna sit around and wait. Glad to know you have my back. I'm counting on you to find those emeralds. What are you doing here? You sure do some fast searching. Well, I think it's important to stay focused on your goal. But it's not always easy. This island is so huge. I'm sure there are a lot of places I'll never be able to reach. Yeah, I'll keep a lookout for the emeralds from the sky. Hurry up, or I'll find the emeralds before you. Wait, Knuckles. Do you have any tips on finding emeralds? Tips? Just dig everywhere until you find them. That's all there is to it. I have a hammer, not a shovel. <sighs> That wasn't very helpful. Looks like I'll need to find them my own way. We have to work together, so get used to me being here. Amy Rose, the one who admires Sonic. Oh, and are you a fellow admirer? Hmm? Now is not the time for this. Your focus should be on the emeralds, not Sonic. I saw a tower like this on Kronos Island. What did the ancients use it for? This was an observation tower. Its main function was to send out radio signals to detect the enemy hunting them down from space. Once the enemy's presence was detected, the defense systems on the Starfall Islands were automatically triggered. Do you recall the tower on Rhea Island? This is similar. The tower here on Oranos Island has already been activated. The great threat that destroyed the ancients is near. What do you want? If you're looking for Sonic, he's not here. You'd better not be up to no good just because Sonic's busy. <laughs> I, the greatest scientific genius, up to no good. Don't mistake me for some small-time thug who commits crimes on a mere whim. Oh, huh. what should I mistake you for, then? You know, I've noticed that there's no sign of any animals on this island. I would expect some to be around in a place so full of nature. This isn't your doing, is it? Don't blame me for that. According to the records in cyberspace, all of the native creatures were transported to another island during the battle that led to the extinction of the ancients. With no one to return the creatures, the island's ecosystem suffered major disruption. Only a few small insects survived. The ancients must have been fully committed to the battle to pull off such a large-scale transportation plan. What was that upside-down pyramid thing on Kronos Island? According to the information I've gathered in cyberspace, it's a terminal created by the Ancients to get in and out of their spaceships. When they first arrived on this planet, they used their spaceship as a base of operations. They needed time to investigate whether the islands were habitable. 
they built a terminal to travel back and forth between the island and their ship. There were terminals built on other islands, but they were different in design. They've ceased to function. All that remains of the terminals is the wreckage of the elevators that were used for boarding. If you're curious, go and find the remains. But only if you're able to sort out the situation here first, that is. to find you standing around wasting time. I was starting to get worried you wouldn't be able to find the emeralds. Then you are wasting time if you're worrying about me. Ugh. There's so much we still don't know about this cyber corruption. Why do your punches work when my hammer doesn't? Heck if I know, but they do work. I'll take care of whatever's in the way. You keep looking. Emeralds have moved. Where did they go? Just sitting here won't do us any good. We need to dig and find them. If the way they're stored has changed, the way to release them should have changed too. If there's a key in cyberspace, we should be able to access them through a terminal. Whatever. Let's just go find the emeralds already. I've been looking for weapons we could use on the hunt for emeralds. But there doesn't seem to be anything. There was a cannon on Ares Island, but it was fired to drain the water in the oasis. I'm guessing we don't have time to go looking for more shells. Hmm. Why would the ancients waste precious water in a desert? I'll bet that cannon was a device that controlled water storage. The oasis must have served as a dam, and it was designed so the position of the faucet could be adjusted. A dam? but all the water went down the drain. The drained water should have been redirected into various watering holes. If only there was something like that cannon from Ares Island here. Knuckles the Echidna. Your power may be the key. Uh, of course. You've got a good eye. If anything stands between me and the emeralds, I'll smash it with my fists. Just be sure not to smash the emeralds in the process. You know, there were underground passages on Ares Island. I wonder if the ancients were building something down there. Tens of thousands of years ago, a fleet of spaceships carrying the ancients landed on this planet. Several of those ships are now deep underwater, unable to fly but their power is still active. Still active? From tens of thousands of years ago? They used their spaceship's power to build a new civilization on this island. The underground passages on Ares Island were one of many paths leading to the submerged spaceships, though they no longer seem to be connected. Oh, it's Knuckles. Stop dilly-dallying and go use those fists to get some work done. Stop ordering me around. 
or I'll use my fist on you! Such a witty retort. May I alert you to the fact that time is of the essence, and you are wasting time. What, you think I don't know that? I know that! Then go use your brute force to find those emeralds! by accessing cyberspace. Go, Tails, go! You've got this! Let me know if I can help. This is your arena, kid. Yeah. I just yeah. wish I had something else to punch while I'm waiting. We're counting on you, kid. go to waste. Don't you think I could have been more helpful to Sonic if I had my normal body back? For sure. In this digitized state, there's a limit to how much we can affect the real world. But there may be ways to help from cyberspace, like how we combined our powers to turn Sonic back to normal. That's true. There must be things only we can do in this form. Tails, cool gadget you got there. Well, I know I can't fight like you or Knuckles. So I'll use whatever tools I can to make myself useful. You do you, buddy. You always know how to help out. Miles Brower, if you and the doctor combine your intellect... I wouldn't mind, but I don't know if Dr. Eggman would be willing. You two are at odds with one another? Yet you would cooperate with him? Of course. I couldn't answer that on Chaos Island, but now I'm ready to decide for myself. When I scanned the skies earlier, I detected a similar reading in the ruins. Maybe there's something in the air. That would be a satellite placed in space by the ancients. There are multiple satellites positioned over a wide area. But why did they put them up there? There is evidence that the satellites were used to send some kind of authentication code. The columns of light you have seen above ground are all masses of electronic data. That must mean the Emerald Vaults opened when interacting with that light. It was receiving data to unlock them from the satellites. You must be feeling quite anxious, separated from your hero, Sonic. Eggman. Have you forgotten about what happened at Station Square? I may not be Sonic, but there are things only I can do. Hmm. We will see what you're capable of without him. There's so much happening on this island. It's beyond my comprehension. It all seems like magic to me. Hmm. <laughs> Here's a word of advice. A scientist shouldn't explain things using the word magic. It's true, there are many things that can't be explained with our current knowledge. The ancients were a technologically advanced civilization. Everything we've seen is nothing more than phenomena that were common at the time. I assure you, there is no such thing as magic on this island. Just you watch. I will uncover the truth behind everything. to find 
find a way back into the system. Sonic is counting on us! You need to ascend the four towers of the Masters. They are memorials to the pilots who gave their lives to save the world. Pilots? They were who I saw in those visions, right? The ones controlling the Titans? Yes, the very Titans you destroyed. Hey, I asked you to explain things from the beginning, remember? That is irrelevant now. Hidden across the island are the components needed to construct the keys to each tower. Find them, ascend the towers, complete their trials, and you will gain control over the cyber corruption. Pieces make keys, keys unlock towers, towers make me more awesome. Got it. Back in a flash. We've got this. You can count on us. You can rely on us. Leave the emerald hunting to the pro. I'm not just a damsel in distress anymore. Just you watch. Eventually, you'll be the one relying on me for help. I feel like I'm relying on you a lot already. Pretty soon, you're gonna be too cool for school. I'll catch up so fast, you better not blink. I looked into it. It seems the tower only reacts to Sonic. Huh. I'm the only one who can activate them. All right, I'll take care of the towers. Let's do this. Yeah, each have a job to do. I should be able to climb that thing just fine, but that's not the problem here. I'll need to go in and out of cyberspace to activate it. You want me to help you with finding the emeralds while I take care of the towers? Uh, just who do you think you're talking to? Leave the emeralds to me. It seems your friends have been making progress on the emeralds. <laughs> I knew they could handle it. But there's no time to waste. You must hurry to the tower. You're right. It's time to get to it. The titans I fought all looked really different. I wonder why that is. There used to be five tribes coexisting on the planet of the Ancients. A tribe with big and powerful bodies, a tribe that developed a tail instead of legs. A tribe that walked on four legs. A winged tribe. And a tribe that was the most intelligent of them all. The five tribes fought as one to stand against their foe, but they were desperately outmatched. As a result, four of the five tribes perished. The survivors of the most intelligent tribe created weapons based on the other four tribes to challenge their enemy once again. The Titans represent the Ancients' determination to avenge their fallen compatriots. I never imagined I would have to join forces with you. How dreadful. Tell me about it. Just let me know when you plan on doing something useful. Useful? Try spectacular. You'll be picking your jaw up off the floor when you see it. Right. Well, while I'm waiting, think you could shock that big guy in the sky? That would be useful. This island is huge. It's gonna take a lot of work to explore. At least it's not as big as the Sandy Aries Island. <laughs> With my Eggmobile, I have no such issues. Even the ancients used transportation to cover the expanse of Aries Island. Did you see the dilapidated bridges and scaffolds around the periphery of Ares Island? The roads and tunnels have broken down over the years, but they were basically highways. Moreover, the highways were full of energy, brimming from underground. The vehicles could replenish energy just by going through tunnels or passing over dash panels. There was no need for filling stations. Oh, but I suppose that doesn't concern someone like you, who can't do anything but roll around at the speed of sound. Levante. Gen, Caudi, Le. Gen, Endio. Le, Finke. Du, Gus, Jurfor. Da, David, Garki. Da, Fasas, Dimipar. Da, 
Don't worry about us. Get going. I won't let you down, partner. What are you hanging around for? Afraid to go off without my protection? <laughs> Regime Dansk Garfa MD Regime Jibais Migan Kitor Duend Dardenai Gwen Redeer Buele Gai Gwen Zak Shure Da Jersey Garfa Tauskin Bab Da Baridrim Koko Zaikta, Dinsk Beerunsa. Then, Nerulas Vaidur, Biskele Gari. The Coco helped show us the way. We've got to reveal those emeralds. Out of my way, I'm working. Levaisk, Garfa, Daika. Leberg. Bilbaen Garki. Bask Juarus Mirduk. Bandel. The Nuke Teron. Andil Mingaira. Jindus Vaira. Letzaidu Guanshi Gaizandu. Medium. Dadre Fask Gai Bais. Then Delgas Vai Gibais. Ingai Postius. Then down for the boys are stored. Hurry, Sonic! For the Coco! For all of us! Is this cloaking technology how the enemy robots appear, too? Aren't you supposed to be training or something? Huh. I guess there's a surprise fourth titan after all. In the vision I saw, you lost to the enemy when you sealed it in your titan. How are you here? The Dao Poryuk, the Dik Legunk, the Ando Baiza, and Jink Boruk Kara, Duke, Jurin the Dudo. Jude, the Gruden Garfa, the Grud, Brenza Xander, the White Funk, the Juan Spure, the Darwins, the Zaikle Varsh, the Garkin, the Dying Dunction, the Vai, the Beer, Van Geisen Milk, the Duro, the Barukir, and the Garminia. Them, there goes by device. Thanks, shots and wipe. Galsa, Galva, Kara. Whew. It worked. I feel like my old self again. Excellent. Now we must go to the one who can forge that energy into a new power. No time to lose. Focus. 
Knuckles needs to weaken that thing's hold on the emeralds, and Tails needs to break them free. I'll handle the Coco. I have a feeling they'll be crucial to the plan. You will not harm this world! I won't allow it! It's alright. It'll be alright. I'm going to take you somewhere safe. This way, little ones. I've got you. We're running out of time. Knuckles needs to hurry. Thanks for handling things, Amy. I'll take it from here. Man, what a shockwave. Amy, are you okay? Uh, I'm fine. Oh, but we need to protect the Coco. I have to make sure they're safe. And they might know something we don't. If anyone can learn something from them, it'll be you. I'm counting on you, Amy. The Coco don't seem to be feeling so good. They're in much worse shape than us. Maybe it's because they're so much smaller. How are you feeling, Tails? The shockwave took a lot out of me, but I'm fine now. That disturbance from the sky is only getting more intense. Maybe our time limit is almost up. Got it. Let's get back to finding the emeralds once we make sure the Coco are safe. Will the Coco really be useful to us? I don't know for sure, but I hope they will. <laughs> I've only seen them get scared and run away. I've seen how strongly they feel for others, even though they look differently now. Well, it's worth a shot. I don't think the enemy will expect the Coco to do anything. Why the Coco? Actually, that element may change the result of my calculations. Calculations? You mean the Coco may be able to help us? The Coco contained personal information of the ancients. And their souls. If they hold data that hasn't been uploaded to cyberspace yet, maybe... Maybe that could be the key! Wow! I saw a mark on the pyramid wall. It was the same mark I saw in the sky when I said goodbye to the Coco. What could it mean? There are no definite records in the cyberspace archives. But it appears the ancients worshipped it as the symbol of a god. They believed in a god even with all of this amazing technology? I didn't expect that. Faith is an excellent way to shape a group's sense of kinship. However, the markings in the sky are a clear and observable phenomenon, and cannot be the manifestation of a miracle. Perhaps the god of the ancients depicted by the wall markings still exists out there today. What's this stone tower? I think I've seen it on Kronos Island, too. Could it be an important clue left by the Coco? No, it's nothing more than a traditional structure left by the ancients. They competed to see who could stack stones higher without them falling over. The winner was determined not just by the height, but the difficulty and aesthetic beauty of their stack. It was so popular that they even had annual competitions. There was a plethora of data in cyberspace about the rules and results of these competitions. It may be insignificant to us now, but it was important to the ancients. Why were they so important to them? I may have knocked some over while looking for the emeralds. There's no need to concern yourself about that. According to the records, the Ancients were delighted when the towers were knocked over, because they could stack them back up again. That shockwave created a massive amount of electrical noise. It's meaningless data that's been compressed and deconstructed, but it will be especially effective against those without a corporeal form. How interesting. Why do you sound so excited? What are you planning? No, oh, as a scientific genius, analyzing what I see and then explaining it comes naturally as breathing. 
Whatever you say. At least keep cooperating until we take down the enemy. While I was exploring Kronos Island with Sonic, I noticed lights would appear on the ground or on the trunks of the trees at night. What was up with that? You must be talking about the phantom lights. Cyberspace is always filled with a vast amount of data, but sometimes it overflows through the portals. That data is the faint thoughts of the ancients, appearing in the real world as light. So they're thoughts without shape, like the Coco. Why do they only appear at night? They're usually in hiding, for fear of the being that destroyed them. And when the moon rises, they feel safe enough to come out. <laughs> the poor little things. They've already lost their bodies, yet they're still afraid of being destroyed. This! Uh, this is what Sonic was suffering from! Handling the Coco is affecting me the same way! Well, too bad. They need me. I won't give up. Hey, kid. Focus. We aren't done yet. I know. I'm sorry. It's just... This was my big moment to prove myself. But I don't think I can do it. Then ask for help. Heck, even Sonic asked us to pick up his slack this time. What do you need me to do? I think our opponent has repurposed the constructs to bolster the distortion's defensive measures. In other words, keep smashing things, and I can start accessing cyberspace again. I like the direct approach. You can count on me. I'll look after the Coco. You just focus on helping Tails. Look for more of the corrupted constructs. Hurry! I'm... I'm fine. Keep doing your thing. It's working. Just a few more and I can hack my way in. We've got three emeralds so far, making good progress. Oh, really? Well, it looks like I'm doing better on my end, treasure hunter. Put a sock in it. The enemy's getting more persistent with their interference, like that shockwave earlier. But don't worry, I'll take care of it with my fists. Just you wait. Amy, something's off about you and the Coco. What are you doing here? Nothing. I wanted to do this, so I'll take the responsibility and watch over the Coco. You just focus on finding the emeralds with Tails. Uh, yeah, okay, sure, uh, what the heck is going on? Tails, do you think you can access cyberspace? No, it looks like I can't get through whatever's blocking access by myself. I'm counting on you, Knuckles. We need to get those emeralds. Don't worry, I got this. No one can beat me when it comes to power. Hey, where's the punk who caused that shockwave before? It hasn't made an appearance yet. It's somewhere far beyond your fist's reach. Jeez, what a coward attacking from so far away. But when it does appear, our time will come to an end. If we don't gather the emeralds and prepare, our chance of success will be zero. There's no time. Leave the enemies to Sonic and focus on finding the emeralds. Fine, but what's up with them? Looks like some of them came back after getting beaten. They're defensive weapons created by the Ancients. They were once used to defend the Starfall Islands from foreign enemies. They had stopped functioning by the time the Doctor arrived, but I reactivated them when I connected to cyberspace to keep him safe. They are powered by Chaos Emeralds and are designed to automatically rebuild themselves by reacting to the gravitational pull of meteors, so they could continue to defend the home of the Ancients forever. Even with the Ancients gone, their Guardians must continue to carry out their duty to defend the island, 
Try to avoid them while you search for the emeralds. There are so many huge ruins on this island. And the four rotating rings on Ares Island are ridiculously big. What a riveting observation. That facility is a kind of monitor that shows the link between the island and cyberspace. The four rings represent the four islands. And when they're rotating, they indicate the link with cyberspace is in effect. When a ring stops, it means there's some sort of abnormality in cyberspace. I'm certain there's a meaning behind their size as well. I imagine there are other functions I've yet to know about. How interesting. When I get back from this island, I'll use the ancient technology I've obtained here to get the Master Emerald. What did you just say about the Master Emerald? Eh, nothing. I wasn't thinking about taking it at all. Good. Because I won't let you lay a finger on the Master Emerald. It's my duty to protect it as the last echidna. <laughs> oh no you don't. Sonic handled four islands of this mess. I'm not going down to just one. You hear that? This isn't over until I win! trying to create more defense thingies. I'll keep hunting them down. You get us those emeralds. Don't stop now, Tails. We're counting on you. We've cleared the way for you, kid. Finish it. Darn. That weakened it, but it's still holding on to the emeralds. Ah, oh, so close. One more should do it. I've been feeling off ever since that shockwave hit. I hope you're hanging in there, Tails. I'm okay, but the enemy might be recharging their energy. We need to hurry. Yeah, let's get going, buddy. Okay, and stop worrying about me and start believing in me. It looks like there are gimmicks hidden all over the place. What I want to know is what was with that pinball in the volcano on Chaos Island? It's a part of a device that controls volcanic activity. When you turn on the switch at the top of the pinball, the volcano is activated and erupts. But it would be dangerous if the volcano could be erupted easily. That's probably why they made a door that only reacts to a special kind of energy and put the switch in a place that's hard to reach. As you accumulate points with the pinball, the energy ball gets charged up and opens the door. Yeah, I figured the device was something like that, since the volcano erupted after I cleared the thing. But why was it designed with a pinball? That's not exactly clear. But maybe it was just a playful idea on the part of whoever developed it. Engineers tend to be like that. Tails, have you noticed what's happening to our bodies? Yeah, the cyber corruption is getting worse. And that means we might get trapped in that lonely place. But, but what I'm most worried about is Sonic. I don't want to let him down. I feel the same way, Amy. I can't fail, no matter what happens to my body. Hey, Tails! How's the whole cyber corruption thing going? I've been making good progress, breaking all sorts of stuff. If you need my strength, let me know. I'm good for now. You've been a great help, Knuckles. Now, I just need to get the emeralds before the cyber corruption gets worse. The cyber corruption has been progressing through your body. Your remaining time is limited. I know. I may not even be able to move eventually. I need to get the emeralds and get them to Sonic right away. I'm updating your information, and it seems there is a new possibility growing within you as well. I was surprised when the Death Egg robot blasted a hole in the ground. There were similar robots on other islands, 
But why was the one on Chaos Island the only one able to do that? Because that was the one that the Doctor was riding when he arrived at the Starfall Islands. It's equipped for battle and has consoles for investigating the islands and ruins. When he descended on the island, he used a miniature vehicle instead to head into the ruins. There, he obtained a massive amount of data regarding ancient technology and transitioned into cyberspace. Many threats awaited him there. After eradicating them, I returned to the Starfall Islands, but the Death Egg robot was already damaged by then, presumably by the heat and smoke from a volcano. So in order to continue our investigation of the island, we composed downgraded versions of the robot he was originally riding and placed them in various locations. So that's why the original Death Egg robot on Chaos Island was the only one that could shoot beams and had consoles installed. We wouldn't have been able to find the underground passageway without it. I did not expect Sonic to hack into it, but if he was able to reboot it successfully, we should repair the original robot and add it to our ranks. That is, if we can get it ready in time for our foe's appearance. I've seen those giant devices all over Chaos Island. Judging by their color scheme and how new they are, I'm guessing you made them. <laughs> You've got a sharp eye, Tails. Indeed, those were power generation devices I built as I investigated ancient technology. The Death Egg robot and all of the other machines I brought in may be amazing, but they're useless without an energy supply. That's why I prepared a power generator that utilizes geothermal energy from volcanoes. If only I had more time, I would have put generators throughout this island to power a super weapon. Such a shame. Maybe the reason the Death Egg robot's beam was able to find the underground passage wasn't just because of the hacking, but because of Eggman's energy supply. I really don't want to thank him, though. The path to victory lies in the technology of the Ancients. If I combine my weapons and the power of the Emeralds... Hmm, you don't look well. I'm fine. Sonic's working hard out there. Even you are, too. I can't stop now. Not yet! You've honed your mental fortitude in addition to your intelligence. You're becoming quite formidable, Tails. Every time I interact with cyberspace, I'm getting more corrupted. This is what Sonic was dealing with this whole time. I knew he was sick, but I never realized it was like this. If I'm going to be at his side, then I need to keep at his pace. I won't let this stop me. against all four of us. You should have quit while you were behind.
Tails, go! You can do it! I'll see this through. I have to. This was easy. Almost too easy. Amy, I know you're worried about the Coco. You gotta take care of yourself, too. <laughs> I could say the exact same words to you, too. The cyber corruption is painful. But if you can handle it, so can I. Well, you got me there. We'll get through this together. We're one step away from the next tower and the next emerald. You got this, buddy. I have your back. Thanks. And I'll always have your back, too. I'm not gonna give up. I'm gonna save everyone. Aw, oh, what's the matter, Sonic? You have to take a break already? Not a chance. Just one more round and then we're done. Or at least, one more round and then we go beat that big guy in the sky. Ugh, if it wasn't for cyber corruption, I'd punch that thing myself. But unfortunately, I have to leave it to you. Don't mess this up. I'm gonna hop on that grind rail over there. Care to join me? Hmm. So that is how they appear to you. How they appear? What, don't, don't you see them too? The current iteration of cyberspace was formed based on your memories. Since linking with it, your memories are now affecting things even outside of cyberspace. As a result of the link, many of the things you see around you are recreations from your memory. It is a testament to how deeply you are linked with cyberspace. I have scanned the area you are pointing to, and my sensors are not picking up anything. To my eyes, there is nothing there. Wasn't there a similar pyramid-looking thing on Kronos Island? Are they related? Maybe to shoot something into the sky? That is incorrect. They are terminals. Kronos Island's pyramid was the docking point for the ancient spaceships. The power source is still running, so it is still afloat. Other than that, the rest of its functions have long since ceased operating, and the elevators were destroyed. Huh. Well then, what about that cool spiderweb-looking thing under it? It doesn't look like it's got anything to do with spaceships. That section was essentially a harbor, not only for spaceships, but also for other ships traveling to the other islands. There used to be a resting area in the lower levels, an important space for the ancient travelers. Now it is but an architectural curiosity. So we've been following the Chaos Emeralds trail and Knuckles is here for the ruins, but what's Big doing here? I mean, not that there's anything wrong with just going fishing. Fishing? If you are talking about the purple portals, those are not real locations. They are a type of cyberspace recreated from your memories. I am not picking up any signals like those of the doctors or your friends from those areas. The big the cat that you saw is most probably an illusion recreated from your memory. The fact that you were able to converse with the illusion and believe it was real speaks of how vivid a memory you have of him. Normally, traveling between spaces is said to cause a feeling of danger at such a level that even you would be able to pick up on it. Well, it was just big, so it didn't feel dangerous. But it's good to know that the real big is out there, safe in the jungle somewhere. The next tower will be the last. It's time for your courage and speed to transcend fate. Courage and speed? Cheering me on, are ya? Well, this is getting interesting. This place is full of unknown possibilities that may throw off my calculations. Well, if it's not impossible, that's good enough for me. Let's do this. Please, use your potential to protect the doctor. Hey, Eggman, you found the emerald yet? <laughs> You can't rush, genius. And besides, you haven't even finished that tower. What are you waiting for? Huh. You can't rush, Sonic the Hedgehog. I'll be back in a flash. Gun Zabaiba. Kain Garfa. Mark,
Wow, somebody's feeling high and mighty. Anyway, Sage says you're the one who can turn the cyber corruption into new power. Is that right? The Viper Knight. The Bull von Karinger. Bande Falkas Puskin Viper. The Vike. The Edo Wandi. The Dinx Wando Dinx. The Ubergeir Garkus Wands. The Drey Posen Chura. The Birken Gruder Karki. The Bike Muken Dazurud. The Edo Wandi. And now you're a rock in a chair. Yeah, and I'm short on time, so if you want me to save your legacy, you're gonna have to fast track this new power process. I can feel it! Oh, I can't wait to let loose. Vandaji! The power of the Urfe! Vandirain Dalda! The Zaruk Padres Parum Dad's King! Vamidis Parum Forces and Gaida! Huh. I'm not used to holding back. The Fosen and you join you. Jew! I am the Samadhuru Red Saiki. The Kaidan Monro Wandi. Daruk's Brian Dai. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> hey, nice of you to catch up. Were you successful? Naturally. Good. Unfortunately, your friends aren't handling their cyber corruption nearly as well. Oh, you guys are the best. What does that make me? Fashionably late. But, hey, you tried. We're out of time! I command you to save us!
Master King. Looks like I'm going all out after all. You did well, Sage. It's time to head home, dear daughter. Home? I like the sound of that. Father.
So, that was fun. <sighs> but I guess it's time we got moving. I know you all have big plans. You're gonna hardly recognize me when we see each other again. I wonder if Cream and Sticks are free. <laughs> Make a road trip out of it. It'll be good to get back to my island. At least, for a while. We're wasting daylight! Let's go!